G'day everybody, welcome back to Reactive Gaming with Chris and James, and welcome back to the Sons of the Forest. We are back with the rabbit farm, James. Farm, not a factory. It's a farm. It's a farm. <laughs> it's a farm. Okay, done a little bit of work. Uh, the front area is kind of finished. Not sure if I'm happy with it yet, but it'll do for now. The overhang is done because we want to do the roof. That was the last thing we were supposed to do um, yesterday. The figure, we figured the only way we're going to get it to look good is by extending it out, making it four, is it four? Yeah. Four by four, uh, four by whatever. Uh, four wide, so it's all going to be like proper uniform. Yeah. Let's go up there and finish off the roof. What do you reckon? Should be good. I'm Should just be gonna, easy. Just going to fly up there real quick. Oh. And we're going to start it like we started it yesterday. But this time it's actually going to work. It's going to be a very, very, very simple roof, but, you know, it's going to look better than a big flat bit of nothing, you know? Don't you think, James? Yes, it will. It will. Um. It should look pretty decent. I don't know what we're going to do for lighting yet. That's what you were asking me before, right? Yeah, yeah. I don't know whether we go... Uh, light bulbs or torches. I have a feeling torches will probably look a lot better. Yeah. Don't you think? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. We'll, we'll have a look. We'll try it out. Uh, what do we go? Three quarter, eh? Yeah. So three quarter... Go, yeah, three, three quarter, quarter half, then... Three quarter there. I think... That's right. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Then a halfy, halfy. We'll just quickly do all the other bits and pieces like that first. It might be easier than lifting it in case we get it wrong. Yeah. And then a halfy, yeah, and then a quarter. And so forward. Yep. And yeah. we got to fill in. All right. You're doing halfies. Yep. Cool. Should we fill in? Hey, yeah, yeah. So it doesn't, you can't see it from the inside? Yeah, yeah, against the, uh, yeah. Yeah, give it, a, you could put windows up there if you wanted to. Oh, I suppose. There's not going to be, uh, like a way up here. No, okay. I don't know if there's much point. It might look better. I don't know. Uh, they're supposed to be halfies, dude. Not three quarters. Oh, damn. Oh. Terrible, terrible, terrible. The other way. And now we're going to go quarters. It's going to be the easiest roof ever now that we can actually do it properly. Yeah. Because yeah. you're look, you know, you're trying something that looks yeah, overly that looks complicated. As and, usual, yeah. Well, sometimes it's your only choice, isn't it? Yeah. Unless you make the roof proper. Yeah. Well, right. uh, this is a lot uh, low maintenance. You just, yeah. Well, it's definitely a lot easier. Yeah. All right, let's finish this roof, and we're back in a second. Alrighty, the roof is almost done. A lot easier than what we we're planning on doing, eh? Yes, definitely. Definitely. A lot easier. That should look pretty cool. Yep. I don't know about the uh, filled in part. Maybe we could maybe we should put some windows there or something or yeah. or maybe we could put planters up there. What do you reckon? Yeah, you could put planters up there, you could put disc in, you could put We um, could just coat it with planters so it looks all green up there. Yeah. High and lows, yeah. Yeah, or, or just lows. Just a little, say along here, along the bottom uh, bottom edge. Yep, yep. I think that'd look pretty good, especially if you get the big bushy uh, blackberry ones. Mm-hmm. Sounds like a plan. Yep. Now we lay. Yay. The fun part. Don't miss There's any. There's going to be no lag, hopefully. Well, so far so good. This server is a hell of a lot better than the other one we're working on. Yeah. 
You know the good thing about creative mode? Oops. There's plenty of things good about creative mode. Yeah, but you know the best part about creative mode is? No waste. Yes. When you're doing the corners, yep. there is no... Oh, man. Uh, there is none of that off-cut yeah, bullshit, no you know? Yeah. Which just bogs you down. It does. It does. Oh my god, this is so much easier. It's uh, a very, very, very simple roof, but it's a hell of a lot better than a flat one, in my opinion. Yeah. And it's very subtle. Yep. Very subtle. So what were we thinking about doing on the inside? Sp particularly the upstairs part. Oh. The downstairs yeah, part, I kind of know what we're going to do. The upstairs, yeah. are we going to do the exact same thing, or we're going to change it up a little bit? Well... I was thinking about some room. rooms. Oh. You know? Like but a butcher's room, or...? Well, yeah, or like a kitchen or something like that. Um, basically a preparation area. A meat packer's place. <laughs> Package yeah. it up and send it out to the uh, natives. Yeah. The locals. Yeah, we'll even do drive through <laughs> We could do delivery. We'll send Calvin. Yeah. No hurry for him to come back. Actually, no. We'll send V. Ooh, we'll get more. We'll get more. No, nah, we'll get more customers. Yep. Calvin will scare away with his stupidity. <laughs> he's, he's a he's a bit of a dopey bastard, you know. He might get the orders wrong too. Oh, he would hundred percent get them wrong. You ask him to deliver to the um to the helicopter pad and he winds up at the the big lake. <laughs> Kinda wish they made Calvin intelligent. Instead of, you know slow. Yeah, but the silly part about it is he's not carrying any weapon at all. That's what doesn't make sense to me, eh? Yeah. He's literally one of the, um... The militants. Or yeah, the militants. whatever, yeah. you know, the, the the people here to rescue and, yeah. you know, all that. And what has he got? He's got no weapons. He's got no way of even defending himself. He's a coward. He cowers when, you, when, a, when a gun, yeah. you know, goes off. And how does he cower when he hears a gun? I thought he's deaf. Yeah. I just thought of that, actually. There's a lot of... Um, so when a gun goes off, you yeah. see him how he crouches and goes sort of into the fetal position? Yeah. How does he hear it? Better still, how does he hear the um, cannibals coming for him? Hmm. I now wonder. Yeah. I never thought of that before until just then. Yeah. How does he know? I don't know. Visually is about it. Well, yeah, but he's not always looking when you fire a gun. No. You know what I mean? Like, I've only just put two and two together then. I've never There's even thought about it. There's a hole in the plot, mate. Yeah, I think we found another hole end night. Yep. Fix it. Fix it now. Could have been happening, boys. Fix it. <laughs> All right. I'm going to start the planters up here, get them starting to grow. There's yep. nothing else that's going to be in the way up here. Oh, actually, you know what? I'm going to do some torches first up there. I think that'll look better. I oh, know. I'll do the planters first because yeah. then I know where I'm going to put the torches. Have you um, given much thought to downstairs as far as the window sort of scenario is is, is um, down there with the cannibals jumping inside through the gap? No. Honestly, I haven't thought about it. In any way, shape, or form. Okay, then. That's fine. Yes. Um, we haven't had any issues with cannibals coming through here yet. Because the bunnies have been getting them. Nah, I don't think it's that. <laughs> I, I just... <laughs> I don't know. We just haven't any had any problems, to be honest. But it is still early days. Remember that. Yeah. What are we at? Probably... Day, day four? four or something, day or four or five or some shit like that. Yeah. Yes. Not much. Um, they don't really start revealing themselves until, I don't know, probably day 20 or something like that, eh? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 
Mm. Everyone will be so much happier that I'm actually using the shift key to do this. Are you? How much? Ooh. How much flack I used to get? Yeah, that's right up there with. Why don't you use the shift key? Should I double it? Yeah. Double the plants. Double it. You reckon? Yeah, go it up. All right. Come on. All right. I will not quite the full height, but yeah. All right. We'll make it nice and bushy. Do you know on this build we have not killed one tree? Uh, um, that's not true. Did you kill a tree? Uh, it was a little one. If that makes it any better. Oh, this is hard to do when you're flying and holding shift and using a controller. Yeah. Certainly is. Um, it was only a little tree. I accidentally threw a log at it. Oh, so it was a shrub. A um. Yeah, it was one of the little little trees. It wasn't like a big tree that we okay, normally cut right, down. Well, yeah. Well, as long as you kept the big ones. Yeah, well, I haven't needed to um, get rid of any of the big ones that, because we're building mostly on water. Isn't that a benefit? Eh. Saving the countryside? Saving every tree like a hippie. Yeah, but the um, thumb in the um, you get good shots. It's very, um, how you say aesthetically pleasing yeah that's true well the thumbnail always needs to have trees in it yeah that's a given yep you can't have a good thumbnail without decent scenery that's just how it works yep no use fighting it like you know uh, no one will know because no one probably watched it but we did a prison build on the water yeah. admittedly, admittedly we were pretty new to the whole YouTube game and we didn't know how to do thumbnails. We didn't know how to do this sort of stuff. So, yeah. But it got, like, no views. Yeah. But I, I reckon I put it down a lot to the thumbnail as well. Yep. Okay. okay. So what we should have done was try and activated the sharks jumping out of the water. <laughs> and Kelvin could be a prisoner trying to escape. Yeah. Hey, um, can you give me a hand yeah. filling some of these planters in, please? Yep, on the way. All right, we'll be back in a second once we uh done some of these planters and a few other little things. Alrighty, they are all done. And they look pretty cool, actually. What do you reckon, James? Reckon they look awesome. Yep. We got they looking awesome, mate. One more row down here, man. Holy Moses. Yeah, we're going to deck it out. It's going to be green. Like yeah. I said, it's not a factory. I don't want it to look like a factory. I want this to be like a sanctuary that we harvest. <laughs> that we harvest meat Hang from. On. <laughs> Hang on. That sounds like a factory to me. Hey, it's not a factory. What it's, is it? It's a farm tomato, that potato? we that we that we harvest. Oh, tomato, tomato. All these rabbits look pretty damn happy to me. Yep. Uh, no, they don't. They don't look no. happy at all. Uh, oh, there I've we go. The oh, they were sleeping or something or resting. Yeah, it's pretty, um, it's not very common to find, like, other than brown ones, eh? I yeah. found a black one. There's one there. There's a black one or a gray one or dark gray or whatever gray it is. There's a gray one here. There's yeah. A, yeah, gray one here, yeah. Yeah. Actually, you know what? We haven't done. I haven't checked the traps. Yeah, here you gone. If <laughs> raccoon just died right in front of me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I think rabbit farming might be a good way, a good job, because they make stuff all noise. Ah, I got one. Actually, I'm going to put him out front. There you go, little buddy. Are you taunting them? No. I would never do that. Never, ever. Have you ever seen the Holy Grail? Of? No, the Holy Grail. Monty Python's Holy Grail. No, never. There's a rabbit in there with big burly teeth that kills people. Oh, really? Yeah. I've never been a big fan of the uh, Monty Python yep. thing, eh? Yep. The only way to kill the rabbit 
is by throwing a holy hand grenade at it. Is that legit? Yep. Or did you just make that up? No, no, no. And you've got to count to um, you've got to count to five, but not allowed to use four. How do you count to five without counting using four? Don't know. Okay. It's a Monty Python thing. Yeah. Okay. It's, there's a reason why I don't like him. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, what are we doing now? So we got to get the upstairs done. So the upstairs, do you think we should use that for the food storage? Yeah, I'd be... Like, I'm talking like racks, um, racks, racks and yeah. shelving and all that sort of stuff, maybe? Yeah, yeah. I think... Oh, sorry. When, um, when these uh, rabbits start populating, you're going to be wanting um, uh, hatches. That's what I... We have discovered hatches. Hatches, yes. You'll be needing and needing more of them as well as dry racks. Okay. Because eventually it's going to get to the stage where you're going to have too many, too many rabbits. Yep. And you've got to sort of go, well, is 75 hut hatches or hutches mm -hmm. enough? Gotcha. Okay, so we're not going to fill them all up. We'll have a whole bunch ready to go. Yeah. So as they start breeding, we'll start moving them out, eh? Yeah. Okay. How long does it take them to start breeding? Um, normally around about uh, three days, I think it is. Three in-game days? Yeah, three three in-day days. And three in-day games. <laughs> okay. Deep, 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 that's all, folks. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> Three in game days. Yes. Okay. And then um, from that point on, they sort of just keep on every day, sort of thing. Yeah. Okay. So we've got to wait three in game days. Yeah. Thereabouts. So that shouldn't be hard. That shouldn't be hard. No. We'll probably, by the time we finish this, what we're going to do, it'll be about right, about time for them to start, you know, yeah. breeding and whatnot. Yep. Okay. We'll be back soon. We're going to start having a bit of think what, where we're going to put things, what we're going to do. Yep. Got a couple more fish to lay here, James. Cool, cool, cool. I think our traps are pretty much depleted. Oh, no. No, they, they got quick turnaround, they have. Yeah, these are all empty. Oh, there we go. Yep. We're getting them uh, out quicker than we could put them in. Yeah. That's okay. Need the, three more to fill those ones. Oh yeah. Drawing final. This is us. the um this is what we've done. So the inside is like a uh what do you want to call it? Like I don't know. I don't know what to call it. Inside it looks like it's like an indoor garden, but Yeah. You know, how a lot of buildings are doing this sort of stuff now to make it green. Like a greenhouse, yeah. but not a greenhouse, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Yeah. They, um, apparently with their governments, they, they, the governments are sort of going, well, you need to make X amount of your new construction. Yeah, green. Green. Yeah. Oh, you made more racks. Yeah. Uh, I'm struggling to fill the ones we got now. Oh, when the rabbits start circulating, this is for rabbits as well. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Have That's we got any babies yet? Not yet. Maybe they're both, they're all male. <laughs> yeah, it's possible. Do they have sexes though, really? Well, that's the question, isn't it? We haven't had to fill up these leaves unless you've been doing it. No. no? Maybe they're not happy. Well, they're not. They're caged. They they wouldn't be overly happy. This little fella didn't get any food. Neither did this little fella. He's like, where's my where's my leaves? There you go, buddy. Okay, cool. So we're gonna go upstairs now. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. we're gonna start doing some workers' rooms, right? And we're gonna put some yeah, more of the hutches up here, I'm assuming. Yeah, yeah. Uh want some more hutches. Um Where should we do like the kitchen part? 
I was thinking this corner up here. We'll make a big Very old like preparation area. Yeah. What do you think? Give it a whole quarter, a uh, whole corner. Yeah, for virtually a whole corner. Yeah. If you want to, yeah. Okay. Um, we'll have like um one log being around that way there, and the rest of that will be all closed off. And yeah. then just um, a couple of. Uh, do we need? Do we need uh, fireplaces? Probably will. Yep. Um, I think if we just have a couple of couple here or something like that. Yeah. Or four? Do you reckon four? Yeah, just trying to work because essentially, if we put um, uh, turtle racks down, turtle water things catch it down. Yeah. Okay. Um, the water will be fresh to drink. The fish will be dried on the rack, so that can be eaten straight away. Yeah. And the meat will be dried as well, so that can be eaten as well. So nothing has to be cooked. Mm-hmm. How about for heating purposes? No? Uh, what, the fireplaces? Yeah. Mate, it's a big open area with open windows. They ain't going to heat nothing. Yeah, that's right, yeah. <laughs> when it goes winter, everything freezes. Mm. I'm assuming yeah. the rabbits will be all right, but the fish will definitely vanish. Yeah, yeah. You know what I should have done? What's that? I should have put some uh, balustrading on the... Um... To protect the plants. Well, yeah, kind of, but as soon as I do that again, I'm going to have to... I'll wipe out the entire thing and I have to redo it. Yeah, yeah. Not going to happen. Took too long. Too long. Here, can I try? No. <laughs> <laughs> You've already taken out some of the plants. Yeah. Um. How about a tables and chairs? Like a dining area? Yeah, like a smoko room. <laughs> a uh, smoko. lunch room. Lunch room, yeah. Um, we could probably do that on the other side. Maybe do a kitchen over here, and we might yeah. do a one on the other side there. What do you reckon? Yep. Okay. Yep. And then just fill the rest of it with... Yeah, um, the hutches. Yeah. Like the other side? Yeah. Yep. Okay, sounds like a plan. We'll do that. Yep. All right, we'll be back in a second once we make a little bit more progress. Okay, peoples. We are finished. I say finished, but we probably didn't do everything that we wanted to do. We'll, we'll figure something out. You watch tomorrow, we'll be like, oh... We should add this to it, or something like that will happen, yeah. you know? Always the case. Alrighty, so we introduced more hutches upstairs. A couple of little ones down here. Just, I don't know, shits and giggles. Got our preparation area, a little cooking area, so we get our meat and everything like that up along here. Got some different ingredients to make stews. So your mushrooms, eggs, uh, all that sort of stuff. Uh, bare shelf, got the fireplace to cook things up. I've never made a rabbit stew before. Have you? No. 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 The only stew that I've ever made is probably like a Greg stew. Okay. I haven't made anything else. Okay. I've never used the mushrooms. Mm. Never used any of that sort of stuff. But anyway, who cares? It's looking good. Yep. Looking good. So we got all these ready to go. They have been finally... Um, sort of breeding and we've been yeah, the, moving them around so the last turn over with them yeah the last time we um moved over to the next morning we got an extra one uh we've probably gained each cage what three yeah yeah three or four each cage and yep. we've been separating them and dividing them and moving them over to other cages so they're all um all going to continue breeding yeah uh, so we got our drying racks down here a lot of fish. <laughs> a lot of fish. A lot of fish. May as well use so, them. Yeah. Like these this farm is, a lot of good stuff, eh? Yeah. They're all chockers again. They just yep. fill up so damn quick. Yeah, they do. What does everyone think? Is there anything else we should add to it? Um, I was also going to get out. I was speaking English, please. <laughs> Doing a James. 
<laughs> I was also going to ask everybody uh, for any suggestions on what sort of builds they'd like to see. Because I'm always keen for ideas. I know James is. Yep. Just, uh, we really don't know what people want to see. So we kind of guess half the time. Hmm. I guess we could just continue doing houses and things like that. But, you know, surely it's going to get tiresome eventually. So if you have any good suggestions, just give us a vague idea even. I'm, ha I'm happy with that. And we could sort of work with it. Because this was actually a suggestion from a subscriber. I'll put it, actually, okay. I, I know who it is. Uh, I, I can't remember off the top of my head, but I'm going to put it up here on the screen for everybody so you can see. So this was a really good suggestion. I really appreciate it. Thank you very much. And, um, yeah, that's... It was, a bit of fun. It it was, was fun. fun. It's something we haven't done before. Yeah. This build is something we've never done before. So I'm pretty happy with that. I don't think we've done anything like this before, have we? No. Nah, didn't think so. Closest thing to this would be the, um, green, the uh, greenhouse. Yeah, but the greenhouse was completely different. But, yeah... Yeah, the fact that it's, it's it, this is green, that's the only relevant thing to the greenhouse, I would say. But I think this looks pretty cool because it's all nice and open. I love this. I love this design, actually. Next time, if I do something like this, it's going to be a lot different. But this was only supposed to be a quick one-day build, but it turned into two videos. Honestly, we probably could have stretched it out to three videos because there will, probably would be a lot more that we can do. If you want to see a third video... Because um, I know there's a lot more we can do to this place. I just didn't want to bore everyone with it. But yeah, if there's anything you want to see in this build or if you want to see another one of these videos from this particular build, let us know. Anything else, James? No, I'm just looking at this here, the, the uh, bushes and everything. I'm looking, I'm thinking Rays of the Lost Ark. <laughs> Actually, you know what so I was like, going to do before? Yeah. Sorry, not to cut you off, but I want to move this over to nighttime. Show everyone what it looks like. Yeah. I think this looks pretty cool. I love the... I always like the night shots. Everyone knows that. Yeah. I think it looks pretty, pretty sweet. So we pretty much got every second hutch has got um, torches on it and the walls too. Yep. Uh, upstairs, exactly the same. It's lit up, bro. <laughs> it's lit up, but it's not overly lit up. Because if you light it up too much, it just turns into a laggy mess. Yeah. Like, this is probably overkill. Honestly, but it is just a small build that... Oh, there we go. I'm getting pixelation right there, right in front of me. Oh, no. So this is what happened. Even a small build, we have too many lights, too many torches. This is what happens. It just yeah. turns into a pixely mess. I spoke too soon, didn't I? Yeah, you did. Yeah. So it's not everywhere. It's just that one spot. But you keep adding to it, it's just going to get worse and worse. Did I see something then? Nah, maybe not. That's cool. Alrighty, everybody. Thank you all for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the series. If you could please like and subscribe and leave a comment down below. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.